Hi, this is Matelli Graves, and this is the Adobe Stock Artist Spotlight Series. I'm a fashion and portrait photographer and cinematographer based in Columbus, Ohio. I moved to San Diego, California when I was around two. Um, I was introduced to photography through my mother. Uh, my mom used to document everything. So from as long as I can remember, she was shooting family gatherings, barbecues. And we used to take walks and I remember pulling out that Canon AE-1 film camera and shooting um, buildings and people and cars and stuff and um, just documenting life. Um, and it definitely sparked a passion in me. Obviously, uh, years later, um, me and my older sister actually are photographers. She definitely inspired both of us, for sure. I wanna give you a little bit of my process. I always look for models first. I'm always trying to think of how I can make a model look interesting in front of a camera. Um, so I don't even reach out until I have a plan. Once I have a plan, then I, I'll go ahead and reach out and then I'll start to build on those pieces as far as, you know, hiring a stylist, hair, makeup, um, and things of that nature, looking for locations. Um, so my process is very streamlined, but it definitely starts with the idea first and then who can fit that idea and then everything else like falls into place. My project is based on cornrows. The reason why I chose that is just growing up, me having three sisters, um, I'm always seeing my mom braiding hair. To me, it was, I don't know, it was just something about, you know, cornrows, the way she twisted the hair, the designs and stuff like that. It was always captivating. And then learning the history behind cornrows, where cornrows was once used to tell a person about their economic status. Cornrows was also used for war and also used for hunting. And then also cornrows was used to uh, carry food or stuff food into the braids for long journeys. For example, slaves that was brought over from Africa to here, um, they had food in their hair uh, braided in because they knew the journey was long. Braids is also beneficial for the hair. It protects the hair from the sun. Um, and it also holds nutrients and vitamins in the hair. The reason why I chose this subject is um, growing up in California, there's a lot of gangs. And if you had cornrows, especially as a black male, you, you was fr it was frowned upon for sure. It wasn't allowed in a professional setting. Um, I used to have cornrows when I was younger, especially during, during the Allen Iverson era uh, with him playing in the NBA and um, I remember applying for jobs and um, I had friends that were, you know, acquainted with the, the hiring manager and being told that I didn't get the job because of my hair, because of the cornrows I had. I remember being kicked out of like corner stores and stuff like that because I had cornrows. Um, cornrows was definitely frowned upon um, when I was growing up. This project was more or less of showing the beauty slash positivity behind cornrows. I look at it as like hair positivity because you have different hairstyles that come from different cultures and no hairstyle or no culture is better than the other. And um, this project was based on that. This project was um, to show how We've been looking at cornrows wrong for all these years. What I want people to get out of this project that see it, um, I just want people to get the positivity, um, the beauty of cornrows, and also learn the history of cornrows as well. And now that you look at cornrows today, um, it's part of fashion now, you know? fashion runways, high fashion shows and everything, like you're gonna have at least one model with cornrows. Um, it's, it's, um, it's interesting to see how um, things have progressed from me growing up to where things are now, um, where things, where cornrows was frowned upon to where now cornrows is a fashion statement. Um, if you have cornrows, you know, it's, it's, it's beautiful, but also don't want to forget the history of where cornrows come from and the meaning of cornrows as well, you know. Um, 
it's just great to it's just great to see um, you know that hairstyle being celebrated and that and that hairstyle being shown in the light that it should have always been shown. Um, so yeah, that's my project. I hope you you know you enjoy it. You can also check out all my Adobe Stock photos on Adobe Stock. Uh, dot com and hope you enjoy it hope you download them and use them for your project and i really appreciate you listening all right thank you